Yeah, just a little bit of a delay though. That was weird. So that was that was a little bizarre there. I don't know what happened there, but it's cool. It works, I guess. So um, right. Anyway, I'm kind of breaking a small rule here that I had. I said that I would not be doing any long form games on my channel, but I have been absolutely <gasps> hi, Baba. Hello, Baba. How goes it? I hope you're doing well. Ooh, four months. Look at you. You are awesome. Thank you so much for, for subbing again. And thank you for so much for being here. Um, I know it's probably it's probably late over there, isn't it? Like, I don't know. I probably guess like seven ish over there. Yeah. No, maybe. So, yeah. Uh, it's eight at night. Yeah, that's why I figured it was somewhere in the somewhere at night, like seven or eight ish. So I was close. I said, I said seven, you know, seven is close, right? Right. Um, so, yeah, I'm breaking a minor rule that I had. I said I would not be doing any long form units because I just don't know if I could dedicate enough time and streaming space to be able to finish a game like uh, say for like Dragon Quest 11 or anything like that. If I'm just doing a two hour stream every week, it would take me probably the whole year to like finish out a game like that. That's you know, that's so media. It's same thing with Baldur's Gate 3. I would love to stream Baldur's Gate 3, but I only stream like two hours a week really at this point, And that's the plan unless I decide to add more days that something like that would take me all year to be able to finish. Uh, let's say, you know, 52 weeks out of the year, two hours, a day, that's a hundred hours. Yeah. Yeah. It would take me, if not most of the year, the entire year, uh, to finish a game like that. So, and then of course I want to make sure to get some variety in my games here as far as the channel goes. So I said, I wouldn't do this, but I have been salivating over this game over sea of stars. It is a love letter to games like Chrono Trigger. And I've been dying to play this ever since I saw the demo. Uh, GM Hina, she actually played the demo. I, uh, Bubba, I don't know. If, did you did you ever play the demo for Sea of Stars? I don't know if you did or not. Um, but there was a demo anyway. And I think it's still out there if you wanted to go and try it out. Um, but I love what I saw of this game so far. And so I've been like dying to play it. So I may not play the whole game on stream. I will warn you guys right now. I probably will not play all of Sea of Stars via my channel. However, I may at least dedicate maybe the first couple of sessions uh, to Sea of Stars, so at least you get a gist of what the game is like. Maybe, you know, maybe like three sessions worth, just to kind of get a gist of what the beginning of the game is like in the first few hours, and that way, you know, maybe it's enough to kind of estimate if this is your kind of thing or not. So, yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started with this. Uh, so, yeah, this is Sea of Stars. Um, I, I'll be honest, I didn't do a lot of research on this game. I normally research the games ahead of time to, you know, to get like creators, developers, whatnot, uh, under my belt. But I, I'm just kind of jumping into this super blind, not just blind, but, but, but very blind, but incredibly blind. So, uh, well, okay. Semi blind, because now that I think about, it, I did see the demo and I did, um, watch GM, Hina play some of it. So, but blind in terms of like some of the background stuff, I guess. I guess that's more appropriate to say. So, I'm so excited. I hope everybody's having a good weekend so far. By the way, I know it just started for a lot, for a lot of people, and uh, for people like Bubba, it's it's kind of part way through it. So, um, I hope everybody's having a good time so far and a good weekend wherever you might be in the weekend so far. And uh, yeah. And the end of September. God, I can't believe we're already at the end of September. And we're going to start October soon. Oh, it's so pretty. I love the pixel art. I I have been a big fan of games that have gone to like this re retro throwback style. This, uh, the 8 and 16-bit styles of gaming. And this is... I, I love this already. I'm also a big fan of like the, the HG2D styles. Sea of Stars has two main characters. Select the one who will lead the party. Uh, this can be changed later and does not affect the story. Who do I want to start with? Well, I think... 
I think Hina started with Valer. Valere? <laughs> Hi, Guaco! October, you say? Big fan of October 8th, personally. What? What's going on October 8th? What's... Is it? Is it her birthday happening? Is, what's the one right... What do I miss? What's what's up? <laughs> I don't know what's happening on October eighth. What's happening? What? What's what date? What? Uh, there's a date happening on October eighth. What? What's happening? A Baldur's date? What is that? Somebody explain to me what a Baldur's date is. Wink, wink. What? What is this Baldur's date? <laughs> Gale did it on eight. <laughs> yes. Okay. You know what? I had to break for that one. God damn it. <laughs> Mother shit. That was I like that. I I love Gale Dinner. And I'm sure Gale loves Gale Dinner. <laughs> it's where I flirt with all of you with amazing DD pickup lines. Yes, yes, you do do that. That is that is correct. You definitely do that. And the pickup lines are really funny. Like genuinely, some of them I <laughs> lies! Oh, are you threatening Gina, Jim Hina? Are you telling her she's a liar? She's got mad at me, Hina. Okay, I'm gonna let you guys find it out on, on stream. Go ahead, you know, you guys discuss amongst yourselves. Meanwhile, I think I'm gonna go ahead and pick Zell. <clears throat> Cause I like that blade. That blade is cool. I want it. Again, I know very little to nothing about this game. So, you know. <laughs> now, everybody on the Baldur's Day kiss and make up. Oh, God, I got to pick a voice for this guy. Uh, <clears throat> okay. I think I'm good. Um... Welcome to the Great Archives Adventurer. I suppose curiosity brought you here. An important trade, to be sure. I just, I see the bandages and I assume this guy is old in some way, so if I'm wrong, I'm screwed. I am the archivist, an immortal, okay, so he is immortal, he is, yeah, yeah. An immortal versed in the ways of alchemy. Oh, hi. <laughs> okay, hi. I see you peeking there. Are you staring into my soul? Perhaps you knew that already. After spending millennia cataloging the many events of countless timelines, I decided to return here to mull over everything I had seen. In my musings about the stories that fill these books and scrolls, I had a recent epiphany. It seems that in my haste, I may have overlooked the very thing I was hoping to find. As such, there is one special story I wish to revisit, one deserving of a witness. Should the mists of time allow a slight alteration, I believe the ray of hope that was once offered may yet bloom. Stop peeking at me! <laughs> Run. <sighs> Should I be afraid? Wait. What? Why? What? Should I be? Should I be afraid? What's happening? What do I not know? What's happening? Guaco! Guaco! Guaco, why am I running? What's happening? Explain this to me. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help it. I can hold it. <laughs> so walk well, now we're not running, so he says walk with me, so there's no running happening here. So walk with me tonight, and we will explore a tale of high adventure. I feel like I sound like what's his face from Diablo. Hello, my friends. Stay a while and listen. It's always time to run. I fear the outside. Oh no, the sun, it burns. 
of magic and deceit, of friendship and wonder. But mostly, a tale of heroism. One that I believe will offer valuable insight in search of uh, in search for a resolution to the throes of the flesh man, sir. Ew. Now, I remain a bit lost amid all these timelines and all their subtle variations. But I know just the one to make for a perfect starting point. Let us see what we find in there. Ah, yes. Our story begins in a world visited by the Fleshmancer. I hate that name! Generations prior. Causing much turmoil and leaving a mark that has yet to be fully cleansed. Somewhere on the Evermist Island, Two brave children of the solstice are on their way to meet with an- My accent keeps switching back and forth, I don't know why. Are on their way to meet with an immortal spirit. In order to become fully-fledged solstice warriors, they will need to learn how to use magic without using magic. How? What, what kind of Gale bullshit is this? That- no! How? Use magic without using magic? The f mm, How? Fine. I'll go along with it. Bring a present without bringing a present. A technology? Yeah, that's it. I'm going to zap you with, with electric hands. Pulls out a stun gun. Shocking grasp. Pulls out a taser. Ooh. Oh, God, I can make more voices. <laughs> All right, we made it to the mountain trail. No, I don't like this voice. Um, Maybe more gruff. I don't know. <laughs> All right. No, that. No, no. God, no. All right, we made it to the mountain trail. I can't do this. I don't have a good vo So far, so good. This is gonna wreck my voice. This is this is gonna suck having to switch back and forth. Uh, why did I choose this? What wh what life have I chosen? What what fresh hell have I chosen? Ah. Uh, okay. All right. This is my choice. I've decided this. This is my life now. Oh, uh, God, now I even forgot what his voice is now. Uh, great. So the Elder Mist lives somewhere around here, huh? <laughs> I'm, I'm over here cutting my bots while you're having a panic attack. I'm... What, what, what have I done? Do you think it's just another test? Could be. But it sure beats sitting at the Academy. And sewing. So I'm a sewing. Ha. Yeah, I'm sure that's over with. I'm sure it's. I'm. I'm blah, 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 blah. Backtrack. Blah, 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 blah. Ha. Yeah, I'm sure glad that's over with. Apply yourselves, for the will you weave into it shall be your sole defense in times of greatest need. While the lessons taught here may appear to be lost on you, something deep inside is compelled to learn. Ah, I don't have two voices! Why do you do this to me? Why? God damn it, game. Hey, the sun will be setting soon. We should prepare the setup camp. Let's split up and search for a good spot. I kind of really don't like the voice I've given Zale, but I, you know what? I'll stick with it. Time for some scouting. 
All right. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm coming through. Oh yeah, this is an incredibly Chrono Trigger, by the way. Are you a gobbo? What? It looked like he attacked me with a bell for a second. Like, what is that? Aren't, I just realized, aren't skeletons flesh mancers? I mean... <coughs> oh, the voices are killing me already. Eh. I mean, sure? They ain't got no body to raise, though. Ah, you were nothing. Brugavis, Brugaves, Brugaves, Brugavis, Brugavs, Brugavs. I it just sounds like I went like Valley Go. Brugavs, Brugaves, Brugaves, Brugavis. That was nothing. Um, Brug. Oh, we're gonna stick with Brugaves because I have no idea. Brugaves wasn't kidding. These. These feel easier to fight already. Let's see where this leads. Oh yeah, sure. Let's go towards the place where I just got attacked. That's right. You are everything. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, okay. Got it, got it. I feel like there's something under here. There's nothing under here. I was duped. There was nothing under there. Ah. Uh, okay. Oh, hi. All right. Um, cool. Sure. Oh, okay. Um, hi. You are big. <laughs> Ouch. Tough one, huh? Let's try this. What? What are we trying? Okay. Oh, okay. We're trying. We're gonna hit it with a sunball. Is that just like a fireball? A Rochevre? So it's a rock goat, basically. You're you're a rock ram. Got it. Why is it prancing? What is happening? Full day for power. Oh, I see. I can let it go at like the right time, it seems like. Before legendary things from It does! It does look like the thing from Violet. Zill, found anything? Just a dead end. How about you? Nothing of note. But the way to the top is definitely through here. The sun is setting. Come over. I'll get a fire going. I'll be right there. Can't wait for more tomato clubs. Ew. I mean, I like tomato. Don't get me wrong. But tomato club. Well, no, it's just a BLT. Really, isn't it? Uh, it just, just like. Yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking too much. Also, sandwiches sound really good right now. Press A to unroll rope ladders. Okay. There you go. Oh, look at that. I did it. Oh, I have to press A to actually, okay. Um, okay, I guess I go this way. Oh, because I have to now go around to where she was. Got it, okay. Anything else gonna jump out at me? Anything else wanna like, anything else want my head? Is there anything collectible? I'm trying to see if like anything's like collectible around here. Doesn't seem like it. Might be like, maybe there's things that are collectible that are like blatantly obvious. This game is like super pretty by the way, like, I remember, you know, I remember when you were trying to play the demo and <coughs> oh my God, those voices are killing me. Bear with me. And I loved it. It does like, it's absolutely Chrono Trigger vibes, by the way, just from the look of it, it, it feels very much like somewhere between Chrono Trigger and like, um, oh, okay. All right, uh, oh, hi. I have to make sure not to die. Nah! No! Ah! Get away from me! Stop! Stop chasing me! 
Oh my god. Ah! Stop it! Stop it! No! Stop! Ah! It's gonna kill me! It wants to eat me! It wants to eat my soul! <laughs> it wants to eat me! Fine, you wanna rumble? You wanna rumble? Let's rumble! <laughs> All right, I gotta get used to this like sunball thing. Okay. So does it automatically shrink down at the end? <laughs> Let's take him. <laughs> you want to take some sucker shots at my banana cage? Want to take some sucker shots at my banana cage, Bobo? -bo? Then let's take him. <laughs> Fucking love uh, Big Top Burger. Anybody who's not watched that, it's one of the funniest things. Wee. Also, like the controls are really good as far as like the. Oh, hi, you. Oh, fuck, it's you again, huh? All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. You want my. Friggin', 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 friggin'. friggin'. Snowy! Hi, Snowy! <gasps> Guaco, thanks for the sub! Guaco, thanks for the sub for Snowy, too! Subs! Subs all around! I love it! Thank you guys. I love you guys. I really do. You guys are amazing. I love you guys. Ha. But it doesn't beat the face you made the first time you tried smashing a sunball. <laughs> now I gotta make Sammy emotes? Yes, please. Please make Sammy emotes. Because your emotes are cute. Hang on. Hang on. Let me, let me, for anybody who doesn't, well, I mean, I think all of you, I think everybody who's on here, like, talking knows about the emotes. But... If there's anybody who's kind of lurking, who's never talked before and has never seen uh, Pina's emotes, I mean, they are freaking adorable. Hold on. Let me find one of my favorite ones. That one right there. The Hoy. You got to do the Hoy. You got games on your phone. So you got games on your phone one. That's my one of my favorite ones. And there's also, where's the other one that I really love? Oh, there it is. Yeah, this one. I love this one. You want potato? Emotes? Yes. Yes. Potato emotes for the win. Please. 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 I would love potato emotes. Yes. Oh, my God. Ah, yes, Guaco. Show off the full range of emotes. They're so good. Oh, I can still hear... Listen, listen, I was, I, don't you elevator music me. How dare you? How dare you elevator music me? I was showing off emotes. I was, Sammy waiting for emotes. <laughs> okay, actually, you know what? No, yeah, yep, yeah, that was, that's valid. That, <clears throat> in context, that's valid. <laughs> Can't help this praise. It's good. You should, you should love, take the praise and love it. Take the praise and love it. She also designed the the potato Sammy. So the potato Sammy you see in front of you, that that's that's Hina. That's her handiwork. She's good. She's cute. Everybody love her. Every everybody love the Hina. Oh, I can still hear the headmaster gloating. As I said, whether by paying attention in class or by recklessly attempting to hit a projectile with your open palm, you will learn the first rule of solar magic. To be fair, you did learn. Oh yeah, that one only took once. You ever miss those years? Before training, just being kids, always daydreaming and getting in trouble. Ellipses. And making mistakes. Ooh. What happened? More ellipses. I'm sorry, Valer. I didn't mean. Oh, what'd you do? What'd you do? What did you do? What did you do? Oh, okay. Whew. I was like, what'd you do? Did you did you break your heart? 
It's not that kind of game. Well, okay, I, I retract that statement. I don't know what kind of game it is, really, but uh, it, it's possibly not that kind of game. Right. Wait, whose DMs are we checking? Mine or, or Hina's? Should I? Hang on. I I have to, like... Hold on for just a second. Um, here, let me actually go into... Somebody we would love Guaco. Oh, okay, it's it's he it's it's he does uh, GMs. Got it. Got it. The GMs DMs. Got it. Okay, we're good. We're Gucci. Listen, listen. I'm just telling you guys right now. You know, let me let me just get into the camera for a second. Hi there for a moment. Um, this is Sammy. Um, I would just like everybody to know that I'm a doofus, and you have to clarify who you're talking to, or what you're directing your messages to because oh sammy check your dms oh i see i did just send you a friend request oh i see well then um never mind let's get back to the main the main thing that well no because i do have to check my are you talking about my uh which dms are we talking about i did just send you a friend request i'm going to have to find oh, okay hang on Sorry while I slip into a more comfortable voice for a moment, but I need to go check my DMs. And there is... Okay, that... Thank you for, thank you for calling me the coolest! Um, and then there's apparently a friend request somewhere. Where did I... I... Is it... Is it here? Is it there? Where's the friend request? Is, is it on hmm my channel no, is it what you're marrying me wait a minute wait wait what did anybody tell me that when was somebody gonna warn me about getting married what's happening well I mean I'm getting married to one of the coolest people ever so that's cool yeah, I'll take it I mean hey you know Hey there. I'm get, I'm I'm marrying Hina? Oh shit. <laughs> Hi. How you doing? Hang on, let me get a little something for you there. I just gotta Yeah. Hold on. That's not working. Oh yeah it is. Yeah. Did that actually come through? Oh, don't tell me it didn't actually come through. No, no, God, did I, mm, did I forget to, oh. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, wait, that's right. Nope, yep, yep. Hang on. Do I not have, Thanks, Yuri. Thanks for showing up late. Jesus Christ. Can't get good help these days. Do you mean the whole time I've been playing with, low, with no desktop audio? Is that what's been happening? Ugh. Stream scuff all, already. Jesus Christ. Hang on. Hang on. There we go. Now I have the desktop audio on. Because... You can hear the game audio though, right? We have audio on this stream. Sammy, you have audio on this stream, but on the other stream you don't. You did that on purpose. Oh. <laughs> Wait, so if I go, hold on, did I turn? Oh shit, I'm an idiot. Okay, yeah, no, there is, there is, okay. Yep, yeah, okay. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I, but I guess I'm not because everything was fine. I, so, yeah. Um, yeah, I was, it was fine. Okay, well, 
You know what? We're just gonna go take two. Take two. There we go. Yeah. Now it's working. Yeah. You like that? Yeah. <laughs> she is creepy. I meant for that. That's that's intentional. <laughs> no, I don't like it. <laughs> you guys love me. Just admit it, you love me. Uh, this is an ad starting soon, so we're just gonna. I I think everybody, almost everybody here is subbed except maybe Reb. So, I guess DDLC the most same game. It's just Monica. Just Monica. It's just it's all Monica. That's all. Um, God, I feel like, we, like we've been dealing. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm probably going to wait for a second because it was like I said, this moment that he knew he fucked up. Oh, well pff, now Reb is now Reb is sub too. So you don't have to worry about ads. Well then, <laughs> well, <laughs> everybody subbed. Well, everybody that I know publicly at least. So I don't know if there's anybody watching in the background, but if there is, I love you guys too. And you're free to speak. If you want, you can't, don't be shy. Say hi. I walked into a chat room with a burn got subbed. Yeah. And it's the end of September too. I think, right? September is going, going bye-bye after today. So yeah. Yeah. So thank you. Seriously, like, thank you guys for all the subs. Uh, Guaco, friggin' like, s like, subapalooza there, you know? <laughs> Excuse me. Oh my god. The switching between voices is, like, killing my throat a little bit, so. Give me a second while I hydrate. Bear with me. I'm gonna, like, hydrate ahead of time. So. Get some water. Uh-oh, I'm almost out of water. Ooh. When I take a break, I'm gonna have to get some more water in this thing. Yes, well played. Well played. <laughs> now you know how I feel with Kermit. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, speaking of which, I do have a random uh, voice thing on uh, the paw print on the paw points. So I don't know what's going to pop up. It's, it's the whole list. So if you redeem like any points to that voice thing, uh, a random style of voice pops up and I have to do that for like two minutes. So. Oh no, I have to go. Hold on. Hold on thought. Uh I'm I'm getting Oh. Hold on. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. So so ran so I have to talk in rhymes for 2 minutes. Oh my god. Okay. All right. Well, let's get the timer up. Hang on. All right. Let's see. Um Well, I can't do that if I'm uh uh chat. Um God damn it. This is not going to be lit. Oh. Rhyming is is hard when you're not a bard. Um especially because I have to s talk for the characters while they don't walk. God damn it. I this is really tough. This is going to be really rough. Um Why did I put this option on here? I'm going to run out of steam, I fear. You can't get enough. Oh, this idea I should rebuff. Um, this is not how I expected this to go. How I'm going to go through this, I don't know. Um, <laughs> he is coming back with my bottle. Um. Something that rhymes with bottle. Shit, I don't have anything that rhymes with bottle. Um, throttle. Oh shit. You're welcome. <laughs> Bye. 
Damn, Hina coming out with the rhymes. She pulled that one out just in time. Holy shit. Um, just repeatedly say orange. Nothing rhymes with orange. Um, or rhyme I'd have to four inch. I don't know. There's nothing really for that one. And just a second, I'll be done. Ah, uh, that was too hard. I should not do that one for, you know what? I should probably disable the rhyme one for when I have games that actually have dialogue on it. No, no, you know what? You know what? For two minutes of having to like come up rhymes like off the top of my head, that was okay. That was, I'd say at least a C. At least, you know, at least a solid C. Give me a solid C, guys. You know, do I get a C? At least, no. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. C, C. I, somebody appreciated it. <laughs> um, God, I forgot where I was, what I was doing, or where I was going with this. Let me smash. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, oh, getting back to it. It's okay. I understand why he wouldn't want to join us after what happened. It's just... I wish he had said goodbye, you know? After ten years of not seeing his face, just to know he's alright. And that we're still friends. Oh, day, oh, drama, and drama. Oh, why did we have to get ahead of ourselves anyway? Oh, girl. Oh, girl. Girl dinner. Flashback. Ten years ago, and I can't. I don't want to do that's. That's just too goofy. Ten years ago, in the vin in the, the, the vintage, the vintage, yes, in the vintage of Moon Cradle, it's a fine wine, it's a mellow, mm, a good sipping wine, yes. Uh, ten years ago, in the village of Moon Cradle, ooh, it's all sparkly. Oh, look at the little kitties, the 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 kid kid silhouettes. Oh, they're little chitlins. Look at those little chitlins. Oh, they're so tiny. My weapon will be something that hits really hard. And I'll pick a fast one. We'll be unstoppable. I no, no, that's not a good voice for him. We'll be unstoppable. Now he just sounds like Valer. Ah, oh, god damn it. Child voices are hard. <laughs> Why did I do that? Why am I yelling? Yeah. Voices are hard. Yeah, voice voices are especially when you have to rhyme them. Jesus. Imagine all the wonders we'll find after we leave Evermist Island. Oh yeah, okay, thank you. I'm probably gonna need it after that anyway. Oh my throat. My throat. Oh, it's also got the good ice. Mmm, good ice. We have an ice maker that makes like the Sonic nug Nugget ice. It's so good. I love it. I want to see the sleeper. <laughs> Hang on, get over here. I'll give you a sleeper. What's that? You've never heard of the sleeper? Stories say it's a giant serpent and it's been sleeping curled up around the mountain since ever before there were traveling historians to record it. Two people sleeper holes, yes. That's exactly, no way. Sure is, and it's super dangerous too. But don't worry, it can't wake up. That's why it's called the sleeper. Otherwise it would be called the waker. Why not? Apparently, there are hole there's holes in the mountains and the wind blows through them, and that plays a melody that keeps it asleep. Whoa. 
I want to see it too. Uh oh. The bell tolls for you. It's the bell. Erlina and Brugovs is back. Are back. Brugovs. Brugaves. I don't know how to pronounce it. Brugovs. You're going to be uh, Brugovs. It's going to be like Agave. Brugovs. Erlina and Brugovs are back. Quick, maybe we can catch them before they go to the academy. All right, Reb, have a good day. Have a good lurk. Lurk good. What's the book? What do I do with the book? Oh, save. Got it. Yes, thank you. Is there anything I can... I keep trying to find stuff to search. I'm like, there's got to be stuff around here. Okay, fine. I'll just keep going. Hmm. <clears throat> My throat. Oh. <clears> throat> I gotta remember that I gotta hit a. Oh, what's this? Hi. Hey there, younglings. Are you still playing in that little cave down below? Okay, it's just a. All right, that's cool. That's all you. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, okay. Whatever, man. I do like the music in this game too. It's great. These crops are our main source of food. It's hard work, but I'm reminded every day when we all eat together that the effort's well worth it. All the while, I suddenly sound like I'm from Texas. Y'all be nice now, okay? Oh. Hey, wait. Uh-oh. Oh! Okay, this is kind of cool. I gotta say. Hi. <coughs> oh. Ha. Hi there. <laughs> Hi, D. Hi. Jesus. There you are. <coughs> Indeed. Indeed. Hold on. Hold on. <coughs> Bum. Um. That. That. Whoa. I. I, um, hi there. Damn! Playing in her secret hideout again. We were training. I think I could use magic now. Is that so? Let's see it then. Whoa. Come closer, Zale. Open your palm and concentrate. Oh, yes, I will greatly, gladly do so. What about you, Valer? Have you been training too? I can't help it. Have you seen both of them? Have you seen these two? Every day, I bet I'm stronger than you now. <laughs> I'm sure you are. Come here, then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wah. 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 <laughs> this is cute. I'm sorry. That's horrible. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Put your forearm down. I will get you. Whoa, easy now. I can't report to that master if you knock me out. Okay, he's adorable. Whoa. That was awesome, Zale. You did it. I like your beard. Your beard is nice. And Master Moraine. Solstice Warriors. If you are done with your babysitting duties, I would hear your report. Right away, Headmaster. Oh, 
Oh, they're the old Solstice Warriors, of course. Of course they are. Can we go too? Believe me, once you've entered Zenith Academy, you'll wish you hadn't. Let's go, Brugovs. I don't know how to pronounce his name. I keep saying that, but I'm going to make that very clear. <clears throat> and the only reason is because if I fuck up and I, I'm pronouncing his name wrong, please don't kill me. Hey, the full moon is out. He's right. Want to go to the Forbidden Cavern again? Children. Children. It is called the Forbidden Cavern. There is likely a very good reason it is called the Forbidden Cavern. Why do you want to go to a place called... The Forbidden Cavern! Why? Uh, because of tragic back... Yes! Actually, that's pretty much... That's that's accurate. Because of tragic backstories. Uh, oh my. We tried already. I can't open it. Yeah, but last time we decided maybe the full moon could make the rune more sensitive. I'm sure it'll work, and Marine will be so impressed, he'll take you two in for training right away, and then we'll finally be allowed to leave this island. Just like how you want to pet a tiger. Look! I... It's fl... If... If... If not for petting, why fluffy? If not for hugging, why friend-shaped? If... If... If not for... For cuddling and snuggling and scritches, why kitten? I'm just saying. It. Mm. Look, okay. If it's the last thing I. He is looking at me funny. He is looking at me funny. I'm making fun of my. I just... Look, I just want to pet all the things, okay? Is that wrong? Shut up! No comments for the peanut gallery! Hush you! No! <laughs> it picked you up when it said that. Oh, when you said that. I just, I want to pet all the things, okay? Is that so bad? Is that really so bad? I just, I'm just saying, look, if you see a headline that says large brown man mauled by a bear, you know what happened, you know? <clears throat> what if he gets mad and delays our training instead? Nah, no way. Well, we can worry about that after I open it. I mean, if I open it. All right, let's go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This is going to go well. This is going to go super well. I know you want to catch Arlena and Brugovs, but it's starting to be late. Bedtime soon, okay? No, no bedtime. Only time for, for forbidden bad caves of badness. Yeah. We're children. We can do no wrong. We're making nothing but good decisions. <laughs> like going into forbidden caves. Because that's what, what responsible children do, right? Is it this way? Is this the right way? Am I going the right way? I, I'm guessing I'm going the right way. Everything sounds sparkly. So sparkly. Ooh. Oh, yeah, this is absolutely Chrono Trigger, like with the overworld and everything. I can hear like the overworld music from Chrono Trigger in my head already, and I ah the nostalgia in this game is so good. I love it. 
All right, let's save. Because nothing but good things will happen here, right? Right, everyone? Nothing but good things will happen here, right? Right? I mean, it's going to be fine, right? Totally. Absolutely. Nothing can go. And nothing can go wrong. Nothing's going to go wrong. <laughs> it's going to be fine. Why do we go to Forbidden Caverns? We made it. Time to stop for a snack. No, no time to stop for a snack, child. What? I'm not hungry. Yeah, we just left a few minutes ago. Look, it's not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. Facts! That is facts right there. That is like, that's also a GM rule right there. That That is a TTRPG rule. It's not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. Or at the table, in this case. You know, when there's TTRPGs. Let me eat snacks. Yes. Plus, I made something special for the occasion. Oh, you're such a good boy. It's too bad you insert something tragic here. Because I feel like something. Unless this is the kid that disappeared and hasn't been here from, for 10 years, maybe. Here. <gasps> a sandwich. Is that a tomato club? <coughs> oh, jeez. Ah, why? Why do I subject myself to this? Ah, this voice thing. Wow, that's really good. Yeah, no kidding. Glad you like it. It's the jam. I used a bit of sap from the Celestial Willow. You can get in trouble for that. Only if you tell. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 Alright, how do I do this? Maybe like Arlena showed me. Try opening your palm and concentrating. You got this, Valer. I knew it! Oh, okay, you were excited. It worked? It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I mean, yeah, we know that's, yeah, you know, we, we, we know what's about to. I'm in danger. We know what's about to happen here. I did it. Hi, Akira! I finally did it! Or did you? So, what now? The headmaster must have heard, heard the bell ring. Do we just wait for, wait for him to show up? Ugh. Might as well answer. It could be our first adventure. Oh, Carl, no. Yeah, and then the headmaster will know we're not afraid. This is exciting. Let's go. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh This is going to go well. <laughs> Tragic backstory time. Yep. 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 This is the mistakes that were made. Oh no. I I There's monsters over there. Let's hide. I thought Evermiss Island was safe. There's a chest up there. Guess that's only true for Moon Cradle. We should go back. They look dangerous. Yeah, good call. Uh oh. Watch out, there's another one! Uh oh. Well. Uh. This is bad. We're surrounded. Hi, demon. Hi, speed. Maybe try to use your powers. 
We're not ready for this. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my God, it's like, this is a bad idea. What? I, I don't know, just try. Okay, let me focus. Watch out, it's preparing something. Come on, come on. Zale, watch out. Oh no. Oh no, what happened? Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. My eye. Oh no. It really hurts. I I can't see. There's no escape. It's about to attack again. So it was you. Oh boy, be in trouble. As resourceful as you are reckless, I see. Headmaster, girl needs help. It feels better. Like anyone born in Moon Cradle, a regular kid. Uh, wait. Like anyone? Oh, okay. I just had to like reread that a little bit. Like anyone born in Moon Cradle, a regular kid. What Carl needs is to not concern himself with the affairs of these Solstice Warriors. I'm really sorry, Headmaster. It was all my idea. Hey. Be thankful that the only cause of this lesson was an eye, young lad. As for the two of you, if you are so eager to receive training, I shall oblige. Okay. Follow me. Oh boy. Oh. It just seemed like the right time for that. <laughs> like, did he lose an eye or did he just like get hurt now? <clears throat> Make sure to treat the wound and soothe the poor kid. He's not the complaining type, but if the pain seems to return, please send for me. Understood, Headmaster. We'll not see your friend for a very long time. If you have any parting words, speak them now. I... Can't he come and stay with us? How long is very long? Like a week? Oh, we lamb. Oh, we lamb. Oh, the eagerness of youth. It takes years to properly train solstice warriors. Years? No way. But... Your friends have much to learn. I would suggest you use that time to reflect upon what happened today. With any luck, it will help you forget any idea of getting involved with a burden that is not yours to bear. Guys, don't forget about me. Never. We'll train really hard. Maybe it won't take so long. And they never see him again. Ooh, glowy spot. Welcome to Jurassic Park. I mean, uh, Zenith Academy. 
In this ancient place of knowledge, you will learn everything you need to know in order to become true solstice warriors. We've been waiting for this for so long. When do we start? Tomorrow. Though well, I believe a proper a proper direction is in order. Ba 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 ba. Careful now. Another elevator! Jesus, how many elevators are in this place? You gotta have music, elevator music in the elevator. Yeah, oh Jesus, wait, what? No, oh, hey, hey, hey! Just keeps going! A few moments later. There we go, Jesus. That took a minute. <laughs> Too late, we're off the elevator! Elevator's done! It's over! Welcome to the classroom in the sky. Whoa, it's beautiful. I'm feeling a weird resonance, like when I opened a forbidden cavern. You mean the place you weren't supposed to go? Good on you for noticing that. Getting closer to the stars helps new recruits get acquainted with their innate magic. It shows great promise that you were able to feel it before. And Zale, too, from what Erlina told me. Oh, it was just a small burst. I have no idea how much potential they have. It is probably for the best. Now, in the many years you will spend at Zenith Academy, you will learn about the duties incumbent upon Solstice Warriors. Of the magic you are destined to wield, and the evils it is meant to cleanse. We learned how to fight too, right? Naturally. You will spend your days training and studying, but most importantly, sewing. Sewing? That sounds boring. Oh, I can assure you that it is. Oh no! A mandatory task, nonetheless. All who will join our order begin by weaving their will into an enchanted piece of fabric, the staple of the Solstice Warrior. Oh, they make their own enchanted cloth. Got it! It is their most prized possession, guaranteeing that light in the darkest places, and a measure of the protection against the minions of the Fleshmancer. Ugh, I don't like saying that. The, the Fleshmancer. Ugh. Feels like I'm like, like vomiting it out. The Fleshmancer. The Fleshmancer. Blech. But first, you must learn of your duties, train until you cannot feel your limbs, and then train some more. Once both your body and mind are ripe with potential, <laughs> you will create a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars. You will then be sent out beyond the Forbidden Cavern to meet with the Elder Mist, for it alone may officially grant the title of Solstice Warrior. Sewing. I understand it is not what you were hoping for, but it is what is required of you for the time being. Years of sewing. Oh boy. You got all your VODs cut? Woo! Congratulations! Congratulations to you, Hina! You did it! You worked really hard. I'm proud of you. That will be all for today. You will be spending a lot of time in these halls, so you should make yourselves at home. To your left is the training room. You ought to go there first thing in the morning. Just above is the, is the way to my chambers. It is off limits, of course. And to your right are the dormitories. Just make sure you pick a bed light with your innate magic. Feel free to look around, then go to sleep when you are ready. Good night. Oh, okay, I can move. Got it. So this is the training area. Dude, it's so pretty. Like This is really cool, I gotta say. I love this.
I do love the pixel work in this game. The, the pixel art work in this game is so well done. Oh, there you are. Marine finally decided that you were ready. Okay, what do I do? Rack full of wooden training weapons. But I want one! Give me one! I want I want a weapon! Give me the weapon! Oh, can't go up there. Got it. I'm guessing the same thing with this ladder. Let's see. Is it? Yep, yep, got the same thing. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, yep, that's cool. Fine. Well, it's been about an hour, so let's go ahead and take a quick breather here. Um, I'll be right back in a little bit. As Hina would say, go get a drink, go get a snack, whatever you need. We'll be right back. Hey there. How's everybody doing? Hope everybody's got their snacks and drinks and got a little bit of rest during that break. Hope everybody's having a good weekend. Thank you for joining, by the, joining me, by the way. Boy, I can't talk suddenly. <laughs> oh man, that smooth jazz, so smooth. Just slipping and sliding all over the place. Um, yeah, so I hope everybody's doing okay. Thank you everyone who's joining me on stream. I know I'm trying to think of everyone I saw so far. Um, I'm, there's one person I know I'm forgetting, but I have to like scroll up. Yeah, Akira, there we go. I was like, who am I forgetting? Uh, so yeah, Akira, Speed, Guaco, Bubba, uh, Reb, Snowy, GM Hina, of course, my beloved. Um, have I forgotten anybody? Anybody else joined that, I, that I'm forgetting? Who did I forget? Yeah, you're my beloved. Of course you are. You're my one and only. Everybody say hi to Hina and, and tell you love her. Because she's amazing. She's gonna be- yes, yes, accept our love. Accept our love. You will take our love and you will like it. Take our love. Let us love you. We love you. Let us love you. <laughs> because you're good, you're good bean. You are good bean. That's why we love you. You are good bean. Now accept our love. Accept it. Take our love and like it. <laughs> you have us fooled? No, I, I doubt. I think not. Are you saying that you're an even cooler being than you show yourself to be? That's true. You're an even better and more lovable being than you present yourself to be. Yes, yes, you definitely have us fooled. You're, you're an A plus among A's. No, we will not stop. Will we? Will we chat? Chat, we're not gonna stop, right? We're gonna we're gonna love Hina. We're gonna love Hina until she accepts it. No rep! 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 Accept Love Hina! No! Love Hina! <laughs> love both! Be like the anime, love Hina. Love Hina. Do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Hearts and chat for Hina. Yes, do it. So much love. So much love. I know, I know that's not where your name comes from, but I'm just saying like the anime, love Hina. I'm saying to love Hina. Asses. You call me a goofy ass. I mean, I am, but are you calling me that? Uh, I guess I. I guess I'll accept that. I'll accept it. Fine. All right, enough goofing around. Let's get back to the game. Enough smooth jazz. I guess I have to go to the dorm room. So. Enough pussyfooting around. Oh, who are you? 
Okay, packs are lurking. Okay, thanks for popping him back in, uh, Reb, and showing yourself again. <laughs> I remember when Arlena and Brugovs were your age, they wouldn't stop running. Ah, uh, I feel old now. I feel that. For those of you who don't know, I work in a school. And so, lately I've been seeing a couple of our, like, people who graduated from, like, one side of our school now bringing their own kids years later to, like, you know, the kindergarten side of our school. And I'm like, ugh. Wanna make me feel old, that's how you do it. I feel so ancient. Sewing basics. <laughs> Is that all? Okay. I don't like the whole sun and moon thing going on here. All right. So. Go to sleep? No, not yet. I want us to look around. It's probably nothing to do here yet, but. Let's see. <laughs> I think this bed is for me. Let's find yours. What did Sammy do while I was eating? Uh, nothing. Nothing happened. Everything's fine. Nothing happened. Everything's fine. It's fine. Nothing happened. I just wanted to smooth jazz mode for a bit. That's all. <laughs> Everything happened. The next morning in the training room. A few moments later. Good morning, fellas. <laughs> exactly, nothing happened. Nothing happened. It was fine. It was, look, look. You saw nothing, you know nothing. Nothing happened, everything's fine. Everything's fine. It's fine, you guys believe me, right? It's fine. Everything's cool. Right? A new phobia I never thought I would have. Look, I'm sorry, okay? It was a mistake. It was a tactical error on my part. I thought you were the enemy. I thought you were his little, like, <laughs> this economy. Brugavs! Brugavs! The unpronounceable. So you'll be our trainer? Yeah. why is my, my tongue got tongue tied there? I wish. Arlena and I are leaving tomorrow, but the headmaster was kind enough to let us make your first day special. Are you ready for training? You bet. That's what I like to hear. My throat, my throat, ah. Ah, I reckon these should be well suited for the two of you. Yay, I got a training sword. And a training staff. I thought he was a training staff. All right, let's get to work. Hoo-ha. And now they're gone. <laughs> You got this, Valer. Don't give up now. Any training wheels? Never. Oh, oh, she fast. Oh, she fast. That's what the ladders are for. Got it. Come on, Zale. Keep up. I, I can do this. Ah. Nine, one hundred. 100. That's it for today, you did great. All right, you're a tenth of the way there. Phew. That was a lot. Feel free to take a break. Erlina and Erlina will see you on the terrace whenever you're ready. Okay. Is it this way? 
Do I go that way? I go this way. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just kind of like, which way is the terrace? Is it this way? I need to go find Arlena at the Tarache. I went the right, right way. Hey, look at that. Oh, dang. <clears throat> oh, there you are. Ready to learn magic? Yes. Yes, mummy. It should feel as if something was scratching an itch far away from you. You must focus on the sensation and compel it to come closer. Oh, is that all we have to do? Do you think it's working? Hey, you startled me. I almost had it. Now mine's gone too. It's okay. Just breathe slowly. Earning magic. So spangly. Try to release only when you can feel its current passing in front of you. If your timing is true, it will manifest. On three. One. Two. And something bad happens. Three! I think I felt it. It tickles. Right there. You just did the hardest part. I'm sure your training will go well, but one more thing. No matter what the headmaster teaches you, remember that this is your life and... Erlina! Since you are done onboarding our new recruits in ways of magic, I would provide the briefing for your next assignment. Oh, what was going on there? What? As for the two of you, it is about time you, try you tried that sewing kit. Move along now. It's a loom. And make it a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars, sure is a tall order. <clears throat> yeah, I have no idea what shape to even make it. At least the headmaster said he wouldn't get it right the first time. We wouldn't get it right the first time. Ugh. Uh, I'm bored. <laughs> I'm bored. I don't want to do that. I guess I'll go up here. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I mean, I guess I'm bored. Okay, it's all old books. Just to make sure. Okay, good. Just making sure, you know? You never know. Sometimes something could be a little different. Also, what is with this pillar? I just... It's pretty, but at the same time, it just... It's kind of creepy. I keep saying that, but the Flesh Master left our realm for good when the Dweller of Strife was destroyed. So why can't they have a normal life? And you know the three of us can take the take the one on Wrath Island. On Wraith Island. We don't need them. Prudence, Erlina. There is no telling what threats we may face in the future. Zale and Valer were brought to Moon Cradle by the Great Eagle. It is not the it is not the place of the headmaster to question such things, and neither is it yours. So how much is enough? What about you, Moyara? What about the twins? Rugavs! Do not judge a sacrifice you cannot begin to comprehend. This conversation is over. We will study here while you carry on with your investigation. On the first eclipse after their training is complete, they will join us for the cleansing. Learn as much as you can until then. But... Let's just go, Brugavs. What's happening? And so they trained and they sewed for days and then for months. A few moments later. <clears throat> Faster now. Oof.
Focus, and then release. And the longer a dweller is left to, this, to its devices, the stronger it gets. This makes patrol duty essential. That won't grow for too long, and you have a world eater on your hands. Against such a foe, even a legion of Solstice Warriors would be helpless. Since delaying only increases the chance of a world eater, cleansings always target the strongest dweller known to us. Headmaster, if dwellers are immune to our magic, how can we fight them? Ah, that is why cleansings are always performed during the total eclipse. In these moments only, the dweller's weaknesses are exposed. How many dwellers are left? Just the one, known as the Dweller of Woe. But we cannot know for sure. The Fleshmancer just may have planted other seeds of evil before leaving our world. Thus, we must always remain vigilant. Headmaster? Yes, Zale? What happened with the Dweller of Strife, and who's Moyara? That will be all for today. Oh, what happened? A few weeks later, a sound in the night. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. Zail, wake up. Blair, what is it? I think I heard a voice coming, coming from the from the entrance. I cannot read suddenly. What time is it? Who cares? Let's go check it out. Alright. <laughs> I'm halfway sleepy. I'm sure everything's fine. It's probably just a rat or something. It's fine. It's fine. Nothing's wrong. Let's go check it out. I mean, it's like every horror movie. It's never, it's never anything bad, right? You know, it's never anything bad. Um, maybe it was out here. Where's the noise? Oh, hey, look. Oh, smells good. There's a note. Here's Alan and Valer. If you're reading this, it probably means I got caught. I'm writing this as a failsafe, but I hope to see you in person. I made cookies filled with a celestial willow jam you liked. Ah. Oh boy. Keep reading. I'm doing everything I can to be ready to leave with you when you graduate. Or ready to leave when you graduate. In the meantime, I hope your training is going well. Oops, now the platform is almost up and I can see Moraine is there waiting for me. He looks very angry. I will try to drop the jar without him noticing. I guess that means I won't be able to try a visit again, but I'm thinking of you every day and I can't wait. I hope you'll like the cookies. Aww. Your friend until the end of time. Garl. Garl's the best. Let's go up on the disc to eat the cookies. Yay, cookie jar. This is going to turn out badly. How many bets that Garl's going to be the BBEG? I just have a hunch. Just a feeling. These cookies are amazing. I can't believe Garl was just there. I miss him so much. Okay, seems well at least. After what happened in the Forbidden Cavern. Knowing him, I bet he smiled it away the next day. Haha, <laughs> you're probably right. We can't let something like this happen ever again. At this rate, it feels like we'll never sow something good enough for the Elder Mist. It will happen. We just have to keep on training hard. Yeah, I have a feeling Garl's going to go to the side of evil. So they train and stay so for years. And then they trained and they sewed some more. So one day...
So one day, everyone died. The end. Thanks for coming. Zale, that's the one. I can feel it too. Hold on. All right, I think I got it too. Let's go see the headmaster. They big now. No goddamn, they big. And the room has not changed one iota. Everything's still the same as it was years ago. Nothing's changed at all. Like everything. Oh, hi. There's somebody here, though. Hey, so you're nearing the end of your training. Are you excited? I mean, cool. Oh, excuse me. Still looks the same. Headmaster, we think we're ready. Why, yes, the tingling of magic in the air has been building up for a few weeks now. Congratulations. Moving forward, there will be no more sewing. I can deal with that. It will soon be time for you to leave on your journey to meet the Elder Mist. But before we get to that, the Zenith Academy has one more challenge for you. Oh, our visitors have just arrived. Perfect timing. Oh, it's them. Why, you've both grown pretty strong. Hey, it's good to see you. Erlina and Brugavs are here to help you review the basics of combat. Check in with them, then it will be time for your final test. Yeah, I'm having like, like word stumbles. Want to review combat basics? I mean, might as well, you know. So just attack me now in any order. Okay. Oh, so I can switch between characters on. Okay. Primus can use a turn in order of your choice, but they can only act once per round. Is there like a. There's not really like an initiative bar thing or like a. Like an active time battle type of, of deal. So that's the only thing, like, I remember in Chrono Trigger it had that, so I was wondering if they borrowed that, too. Uh, where you have a bar that charges up, and once it's all the way up, you can act again. Good. Focus is paramount whenever you perform attacks and skills. With proper timing, you can increase the damage that you deal, and sometimes even score additional hits. Let's see it. As it connects to increased damage. Oh, okay. Oops. That was too soon. Stay focused and press. Okay. Got it. Got it. I'll try it again. Okay. That was. Yeah. So one more time. Ah, that one was too soon. Hers I can get for some reason. Spells can be made more potent with proper timing. Some also keep going with one of the hits until you miss. So kind of like a combination of Chrono Trigger and uh, uh, Super Mario RPG in a way. Or like Paper Mario. Time hits as a welcome addition when you pull it off rather than some something that you're supposed to do perfectly all the time. So don't worry about it too much. Just keep on trying. Uh, yeah, okay. Timing your blocks. Let's get to, Let's get the little guy in here. Mission battle, you must pay attention to anything that starts moving. Finch! Thanks for the sub! Oh my god, 10 months. Holy cow! Thank you so much, Finch. I think everybody in this chat is, like, subscribed right now. And it's kind of blowing my mind. Like, I've never had that before. I I don't even have, like, a panic... uh, Panic Sammy emote for this. I, I don't, I, I, this is all I can do. All I can do is go anger face and panic because everybody's subscribed. What do I do? Oh, oh, you're all subscribed. 
I love you all. <coughs> oh, excuse me. We closed early, but I still finished at four. Oh. Oh, God. Ow. Oh, I had to stretch a little bit. Sorry. Wait, so. Hold on. I. I so you closed early, but you, have to, you still had to finish at four? What happened? I I've had those days though. Like I I without knowing exactly what you do for a living, Finch, I've had those days in both retail and my current job. Uh last job was out of area. Oh, do you travel for your work? Is that what happens? You're a locksmith. Oh, that's cool. Right on. I I I'd have to I have to ask, like, what's the strangest, like, call that you've had? But I don't know if you can go into specifics. So, uh, yeah, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry you still, like, couldn't wrap up for a while. I'm guessing because it was, like, way out, like, way out, out there. Oh, I'm so sorry you had to deal with that. But... At least you're home and safe and uh, don't know what time it is over there right now. Proper timing can reduce the damage of any incoming tap. So basically, I probably have to hit. Define strange because there's different flavors of strange. It's almost five. Okay, yeah, that's that's okay. So, uh, Finch, you're, you're East Coast then. Gotcha. Um, so, I, I don't know. I was just trying to think. Like, I, I don't know if I want to go, like, bad strange, like, 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 angry customer strange, or just, like, strangest thing you had to, um, fix or, or deal with strange? I'm honestly not sure. I, I probably just go with whatever you decide is the appropriate flavor for strange for this. You know, I, I didn't really think about it when I asked that question, so, uh. I'll, I'll go ahead and say uh, Chatter's Choice. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm going to learn how to block. Say as a hit connects to reduce damage. Oh, got it. Okay. Ah, no, I can't get it. Got it. Okay. There's a little bit of, of input delay, so I have to remember that. Ah, it was too late. Yeah. Got it. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, what's choice? Uh what is choice? What what is choice, you know? What is a decision? What what freedom of choice, free will. What what is free will? Um I was just thinking, you know, like anything you want to do. You know what? I, I'm sure you probably don't want to discuss work anyway because you just got out of it. So uh, I'll, I'll resend the question. I just literally couldn't process what you said. No, sorry. You're fine. You're fine. Like I said, it's it was probably also bad form to ask you about work after you just literally got off of work. So uh, I absolutely apologize and resend the question because um, I would hate to be like asked about work like right when I got home too, you know, or like at least close to when I got home. So I, I I take back my question for now and I hope you relax and have yourself a good weekend. Not my bad. All right, I got the block down, I think. Sailors sometimes will be hard to read. Yeah, I kind of figured. Don't be too hard on yourselves. No making angles. I know, I know. It's not about getting it perfectly all the time, but rather building a growing sense for it. To read your enemies? I got it, got it. Oh, one more thing. Oh! Oh! Oh, no, you said something, something choice, and that's what I was... I was saying, uh, I'll leave it to as Chatter's choice for whatever you consider strange, uh, only because I did not think of... the. I didn't think of the question when I asked it, and... So I didn't really think of the flavor of of choice in this matter in terms or a flavor of strange, I mean, 
when I was asking the strangest like that you had to deal with. So uh yeah, no, that was just that was just me. I I didn't think the question through. That's all. So I was gonna leave it to your choice to to talk about what the your choice of the strangest things. Okay. Oh, okay, something you still don't understand then? Alright. You know what? That's I I like that. The uh the how did this happen kind of thing or or why did this happen sort of thing? I, I'll accept that. All right, go for it. Oh, you'll need to switch to a more a more defensive mode. I had a guy somehow lock a filing cabinet with the key. What? Hold on. Wait, what? I, I see what you mean now. H how? I, I just, yeah. It's, excuse me. Did did he did he explain? I mean, did he? How? That's okay. Yeah, you know what? That's fair. That's absolutely like. That his 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 name didn't have to be like like Harry Houdini or anything did it like he didn't go like like pick a lock for like Chris Angel or something that would have been hilarious if it was like a magician like Chris Ramsey or something you know it's north of Denton <laughs> so what you're saying is The guy who opens mouths and and fiddles with things with tools for a living locked his tools and couldn't figure out how to open said thing. Well, his keys at least. Uh, it's not an honest. Oh no. Oh boy. I just, I'm, my, my brain is boggled. Like how, how did he, I, uh, I'm with you. I'm with you, Finch. I, how did that, how did they pull that off? Well, yeah, no, that's, that's definitely a, that's, that's definitely a strange story. Um, well done to the orthodontist. Well done. Huh? I mostly just have like a uh, fun fact. He apparently had just ordered a lock pits pick set as his daughter's birthday presents. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, the poor guy. That's just, that's, that's just, that's just a strange irony right there. Is that irony? It, I, I guess that, that kind of qualifies as irony. I think before he locked the key in the cabinet. Oh, no. Oh, this poor guy. I think most of my strange stories just have to deal with very unusual customers. Uh, before I worked at a school, I've done retail. I've done, uh, I've done a lot of jobs. I worked retail. I've worked as a writer. I've worked... At, in a bar and you deal with clients in all in all aspects you deal with clients who are just strange and yeah i mean most of my strange stories have to deal with just strange people or strange requests i guess so he's not poor that's for sure i bet oh my goodness i think i had um when I was working as a writer, I actually worked nine to five as a writer and I worked at night at a bookstore um, for a bit. And I had somebody who tried to recruit me for a pyramid scheme. Um, I mean, it's not that strange. I'm sure everybody's had somebody who's done that. Um, I think it's just more in the way I shot her down. She was like, she was really trying to push for it. And she was like, do you really enjoy what you're doing? Because I was, it was at the bookstore at the time. Do you really enjoy what you're doing? 
I was like, oh yeah, I this is just like like what I do for fun. I just work at the bookstore for for the for the heck of it. You know, I work as a writer in the morning. I I love my job. Oh. She didn't know how to answer that. <laughs> she she didn't know how to answer back. So it was great. <laughs> and that's just small st- I had a I had a guy who was completely cracked out, like walk in, ask me if we have like if this was when I was working at a game store. Just walked in. Hey, do you have GB? Do you have Game Boy games? And then didn't even like stay for the answer. He just walked over to one of the other glass cases. I was like, okay. Um, sure. I guess he just answered his own question. And then he bought something. He got to the door. He didn't leave the door. He got to the exit door, turned back around, and said, "You know what? I want to refund this." I was like. You just bought that, dude. I, you didn't even. Okay, no, I mean, cool. You just, I saw you buy it. I'll just, sure. It was completely whacked out on something. It was absolutely whacked out on something. I have no idea what it was on, but probably have a few things I would wager. So, um, yeah, that's my, my usual. My my strange stories are just that, you know. So yeah. Anyway. I'm I'm glad he got his keys out. I'm glad you were there to to help the poor the poor thing get their keys uh, get his keys out of the cabinet, but I I'm so shocked as to how that happened. So right, KO dollars will get back up on our own at 50% hit points once all the KO stars are gone. Oh, one KO star is removed at the end of each round. The more you fall during the same battle, the more KO stars there are, so be careful. Oh, okay. It's game over. Got it. So I can still live. Okay. Okay. I can survive this. This is fine. This is fine. I can do that. Uh, I couldn't get the... Uh... Oh, I gotta get that timing down. And there you have it. Good work today. I'm sure the exam will be a breeze. Cool, cool. I mean, ready to go through the basis of magic? I'll follow you anywhere. Yes. Yes, please. When enemies prepare spells, you must do everything you can to prevent them. If you follow your senses, you can try dealing damage of the types that will break their concentration. Oh, that's fun. Simpler spells will only demand normal attacks. Belair can do blunt damage and Zale has slicing. Let's see you break this down. Oh. Let's see. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, so if I can nail the extra attack, that actually counts towards breaking the enemy. Just like that. Now, some spells will also demand magic magic damage to break. You can control your projectiles now, so let's give it a shot. Zale for sun and Valer for moon. Okay, so... Deflect, got it. Oh, okay. I couldn't get a I couldn't get that one in time. Okay. Well done. Now you can sense your MP is a little a bit low, right? To keep up the pace in battle, you must remember to regenerate MP. Okay, so basic thing. Wow, we don't get a lot of MP, do we? Pull back up, hit me with a normal attack now. Uh, okay, so attacks come back with Matt. Okay, MP comes back with attacks. Got it. Battle awareness leads to victory. You must pace your spells with normal attacks to avoid ending up in a dire situation. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, this is pretty basic. 
And on the flip side, you should not hesitate to use spells when MP abounds for a regular attack on a full bar is a waste of regeneration. Okay, okay, that's... That's a good way to juggle magic attacks and regular attacks. That's cool. One last thing. All battle actions, lock breaking especially, build your combo energy. But you have enough. Um, I'm just going to break the voice for a minute. You can spend combo points to perform powerful actions. Combos cost no MP and are lost after a battle, so you should never hesitate to use them. Marine told me you came up with your first combo attack. Show it to me. I mean... Oh, I see. Okay, so it's it's a charge, but it actually keeps... Okay, so those, those points on the side are the amount of combos, like, dots I have. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're strong, all right. Keep an eye out in your adventures. You're bound to come across scrolls that, that will... Scrolls? Scrolls? That will teach you more combos. Good luck with the exam. I'm sure you'll do great. Marine will see you for the to see you to the final test. I'm sure you'll do great. Thank you, Erlina. Thank you, unpronounceable name. Are you ready for the final test then? Yeah, I'm I mean as ready as I can be, I guess. But let us begin. Okay. We're gonna fight you? The big day has finally come. Over the years, Zenith Academy has tested you in many ways. It will now test you one last time. And if you fail, you will die. Have you prepared your vows? Uh, what? The vows? Excuse me? Pardon? What vows? Uh... No, no, I have not prepared any vows, thank you. Yes, Headmaster. Oh, okay. I guess they have. I, I guess so. Then speak them now. You go for a sale. Okay. Ahem. So that I may use my agility to, cl to cleanse this world and protect my companions, I will enter the world as a blade dancer. I chose the curved blade as it will not hinder my speed or reflexes. Welcome, Blade Dancer. Mowage! What brings us together today? Come on, Valer. I did it. Now it's your turn. Ahem. <clears throat> so that I may use my strength to inspire hope and eradicate evil, I will become a battle monk. I chose a staff, for it won't break no matter how hard I strike. Welcome, battle monk. Today you must demonstrate mastery of everything Zenith Academy has taught you. Your final challenge awaits below. Please step aside. Oh, before I forget, here's a little something to keep your health full. Oh, sweet! I got tomato clubs! Yeah! I still have no idea what a tomato club is. It just sounds like a BLT. Now, with faith in your abilities and purpose in your actions, take the leap. And return as the new recruits of our order. I'm ready, Zale. Let's just go for it. To me a base club sandwich that's what i was thinking like i mean it's it just yeah it just i mean it sounds like a blt to me you know sandwiches do sound good right about now i think i'm getting a little hung i'm getting peckish i feel like i just ate like i think a couple hours ago no it was more than a couple hours ago now to think about okay yeah you know what's it's, it's a little past lunch time and i am getting a little hungry you know what Let's take another quick break here while we're on a, a major thing. And maybe I'll go see if I can munch on something really, really quick. Uh, you guys go munch on something too, and I'll be right back. Everybody good? Did you guys have a good break? Did you get some snacks and drinks and stuff like that? 
took care of some necessities. On a serious note, I just want to say, like, I'm sorry I haven't been on, like, for a while, and I do appreciate you guys being here. It does make me feel, like, really good. So, thank you guys for popping in and, and seeing me again. All y'all, all y'all, I love all your faces. You guys are amazing, every single one of you. And, um... I'm gonna try to be more consistent about streaming. Um, I know I'm only got I've only got like one day scheduled right now, but hopefully if things work out, maybe I can add more. And I, I know I've said that before, but I really do want to try to like commit to at least the one day, and maybe add some more. I think I might end up. Oh, thank you, thank you so much. So I'm still debating whether or not I want to stick with noon or move it down to 11 a.m. on our time, uh, 11 a.m. Pacific um, on Saturdays, just to give me a little bit more time to stream before Wyvern's Mark. So if I do 11 a.m., it'll be like 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Uh, on every Saturday. And then of course the Baldur's Date, uh, as I said at the top of the top of the stream, uh, Baldur's Date every other Sunday on GM Hina's channel, uh, Sundays, every other Sunday at noon, which, not tomorrow, but the next Sunday, we'll be having it again. It'll be myself, GM Hina, Snowy Tequila, and Guacoviti uh, with more Baldur's Gate chaos. So there's going to be that. Um, and then who knows? Maybe I'll see if I can add a weekday, uh, maybe a short stream on weekdays, uh, maybe Tuesday or Thursdays uh, in the evening. And, um, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll consider that. Um, anyway, for now, let's get back to the test and see what's happening. I think after this test, depending on how long the test takes, I might go ahead and call it a stream there, just because I think it would be a good cutoff point. So let's see. Oh, there's a ladder over here. Let's see what the ladder's for. Oh, it's a switch. Oh. Aha. Sweet. Don't know what it does. There an, oh, there is an item thing. Let's see here. Tomato club. Ornate stone. Weighted stone fits a brazier and see at the academy. Hey, look, Guaco is something for a brazier. If, if Guaco is still around. <laughs> well, I guess that goes in there. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> a brazier, a brazier. All right, let's take these suckers down. I get, do I have to take them down? I mean, I might as well, I guess, if I'm gonna want to level up anyway. Let's see. Ow. Got it. Nailed it. Fraser. <laughs> nice. Okay, I really don't need the heal right now, so. Okay, I got it. I, I've got the timing, I feel like. It's just for the controller lag, I think. You have to hit it when it uh, when it connects, but I think for the controller lag, you just have to adjust when it's at, for these things, at least at the top of their uh, jump. Got it. Nailed it. Oh, that was like a... What was, what was it? Was it not a door? Maybe I, I thought it was a door at first. Okay, I mean, cool, you know? Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Okay. All right, there's a chest over there. Ooh, ooh. I feel like there's gonna be, once I open this chest, there's gonna be a monster that drops down or something. Cause this is way too easy. My stone. 
Ah, I knew it. I knew it. Ah, I knew it. Stop it. I gotta attack them anyway. I have to because they're blocking the rope I need. Oh, oh, cool. Nice. All right, all right, all right, all right. Got it, okay. Now let's see. Okay, let's see if I can nail this. Ah, I can't get that fleck down. I will get that deflect down at some point. Uh, if I can, I think that would be amazing. Okay, that goes in there. Oh. Is this an elevator? Hold on. Hold on, I need to... I thought it was gonna go a little longer. I, I thought it was actually gonna go to the next screen, but I didn't know it was gonna go back to these characters. They haven't even been to the other side of the... Oh, my mouth. They haven't even been to the other side of the Forbidden Cavern yet. How could they understand? So you don't think we should at least try to explain? You've seen how strong they are. Weird will have a walk in the park. Weird will be a walk in the park. Let's see them off then. Okay. Oh, hi. Exam mode engaged. Brace yourselves. Cool, thank you. Uh, okay. All right, I see how this is gonna work. Cool, cool, okay. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to... All right. Robot Proctor. Yeah, pretty much. I gotta get that. I gotta get that down. Okay. I have to attack him. And then now... Okay, I've got to get this bounce down. <laughs> okay, I got one. I got one deflect. Ah, uh, that block is... I can't get that block down for some reason. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Cool, okay. Then I just sack him with this. Was that it? Hey! I wasn't so bad. Nice! Oh, this is so, so Super Mario RPG. Let's see. Well, let's see here. I have the... Dude, this level of, like, sound is a jam. Oh, uh, let's see. What do I want to, like, focus on with, with uh, Zale, though? Let's see. Physical mana points or physical defense? I really think defense is going to be my most important thing. And then I'm going to focus on... That's a lot of hit points! That is a lot of hit points. Oh, 
but should I go for physical attack? I'm doing really well with physical with her. I just can't get the timing down with Zale. But <laughs> more hit points is also good. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, what do you think? What do you guys think? More hit points or more physical? What 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 do you guys think? Hmm. While I'm getting down to this like level up music, I love this. This is nice. I really love the soundtrack. I love I love everything about this game so far. And I love this is a, that this is a love letter to JRPGs. I mean, it's it's really well done. I promise to come to the next stream more armed with with information and data about this game. I just wanted to really jump into it this time. All right, I'm gonna think I'm gonna go with physical attack because I feel like yeah, I'm gonna play more defensive with Zale and more offensive with Valer. Congratulations, you have been trained well. Return now to your headmaster. Yeah. Okay, he just says the same thing. Yeah, yeah. I beat your robot. I beat your bot. I kicked your bot in the bot. Congratulations, Zale and Valer. You have learned everything Zenith Academy had to teach you. We did it! In record time, too. You must now learn our, of our ultimate power, the ability to use magic without using magic. That's, yeah, I forgot that was a whole deal. But that knowledge is for the Elder Mist to impart. Come, the villagers have gathered to celebrate your departure. Oh, do we get to see Garl now? Or am I right? Is he evil now? It is on special days such as this one that the citizens of Moon Cradle are reminded of the importance of their duties. Where's Garl? I don't see him. Many years ago, Zale and Valer were delivered to us by the Great Eagle. Deliveries on two solstices in a row to boot. A very rare occurrence. Oh, I remember. Gran was so happy to get to meet two more before she passed. I miss Gran. Aw. All of you have come together to nurture and protect them. Just like your ancestors have done for so many children of the solstice before. I can't go any deeper than this, so... Zale and Valer. Was it Valerie? Might be Valerie. Maybe I've been probably pronouncing this wrong the whole time. Step forward so that the good people of Moon Cradle might gaze upon those who will soon join the ranks of the Solstice Warriors. This parading is ridiculous. Oh, let the villagers have their fun. It's all they get. So you're okay with this now? You know I'm not. Now cheer with me as we send these young heroes out across the Forbidden Cavern to meet the Elder Mist. Hooray! Yippee! To the gates! What do we do? I want to see Girl before leaving. I guess we have to play along for now. Fingers crossed that we can come back after meeting this Elder Mist. Fingers and toes. Well, but there, I will learn if that is the right pronunciation. You must undertake this journey on your own now. We will not fail, Headmaster. Go now through the Forbidden Cavern and atop the mountain trail to seek audience with the Elder Mist. Learn how to use magic without using magic, and you shall then enter the world as true Solstice Warriors. 
Be the one that might protect you. Be someone that might guide you. Solon Luana, okay, that's... Here, this should keep you fed for a little bit. Yay, more tomato clubs! I didn't use a single one during the last... And if your adventure feels a little tough, you can take a look at these. Oh, sorry to... Oh, okay. Oh! I'm gonna push yourself to max velocity after a range of options. It's bound to be more defined. Oh! Remember to keep an eye out for merchants. Selling any valuables you find will keep you well fed and well equipped. Now, wherever your adventure takes you, you must remember your first assignment. After the Elmer sends you out into the world, oh, excuse me, you must secure passage to Wraith Island in time for the next eclipse. And do keep on training, for dire cleansing awaits us. Still can't believe he wants him fighting a dweller already. That's Marine for you. We weren't much older first the first time. Yeah, but we'll find a way. Safe journeys, and may you cleanse this world. Oh, okay, okay. That's a little culty. That's fine. No wait, there's a chest there. Oh, I want it. Oh. Oh. But the chest. All right. Well, I guess we can actually end the stream here because I did say after the test I would go ahead and uh, cut the stream. So, um, thank you guys for popping in. I'm going to go ahead and put up the ending screen right now. So, there we go. Thank you guys for popping in. I really appreciate everybody who joined the stream today. I'm floored. Like, I didn't expect all those subs. I didn't expect you guys. Really, I never expect, like, I don't know what, what to expect when I pop on the stream. So I don't know what's going to happen. Who's going to show their head, show their faces. You know, I don't know what's going to happen. But I'm glad you guys all popped in. I'm glad I, I'm floored for all the subs. Like, holy crap. You know, that's amazing. Um, and I hope to see you guys again. So for now, I will stick with noon on Saturdays. Uh, but if I do change, you can find me on Twitter. I will go ahead and announce if I'm going to uh, go ahead and go at blah, 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 blah. I will go ahead and post if I'm going to be earlier. Um, mostly on Twitter and Blue Sky. Probably more on Blue Sky than Twitter because I'm trying to wean myself off of Twitter little by little. Um, so if you're on Blue Sky, great. If you're on Twitter, you can still follow me. I'll still post there once in a while. Uh, but I'm, again, I'm trying to really like dedicate myself more to Blue Sky and Discord. I have unfortunately closed down my Discord channel, but soon you'll be able to find me on GM Hina's Discord. So go ahead and follow there and soon you'll have a, ch a channel. Soon you'll see a channel that's all mine. And uh, yeah, then you can like see and talk to me and post up and do all sorts of fun stuff there uh hopefully so yeah uh but for now thank you guys have yourselves a very good weekend do good be good and sammy bear is out